The thoroughbred and the places where these animals live and race are some of the most picturesque in all of sport. It's no surprise then that Central Kentucky is home to some of the world's best equine works that are now available to you at a special public offering. Rebecca Smith now joins us with the story of an artful collaboration. The Crossgate Gallery in Lexington is housed in this 11,000 square foot Greek Revival building built in 1901. The pieces inside go back much further to the 18th century when sporting art was just coming into fashion. This art form represents a romantic nostalgia associated with horse racing for uh, gallery owner yeah, Craig Ladd. You had country gentlemen that uh, wanted to depict their favorite horse or their favorite hound or a pastime that they love. So they, they decided they wanted to paint and of course they know the horse but they have to be able to draw. So a lot of the sporting painters are, are not necessarily trained professionally as an artist, so the best are the ones that can draw first and decide they want to paint horses. Crossgate represents more than 170 pieces of art featured at this year's first ever sporting art auction, a collaborative effort that brings the world of art and sport together. We have what we think are the best contemporary artists working today. I mean, the gallery has always focused on having the best quality we could find. So we've got really great contemporary painters uh, and, and pretty much a good representation of all of the top sporting painters from, from Europe or from England and from America. Of the partnership with Keelan, Ladd says he decided to branch out and offer up more than 30 sculptures and other genres of paintings. We went out trying to capture good uh, thoroughbred paintings and, and paintings related to racing. Uh, and then sort of thought that, well, you know, you've got a diverse crowd that comes through Keeneland for these horse sales. Uh, and so we don't know what their interests are necessarily. So we said, well, let's get some shooting and fishing and then maybe even branch out into some American realist paintings, uh, Jamie Wyeth and, and, and that whole school up, up in the Chad's Ford, Pennsylvania area. One of the most notable is this Mary Cassatt painting. It's a painting of uh, a mother and two children and, and a cat in uh, one of the children's lap. Uh, so, you know, it doesn't necessarily fall into sporting art, but again, we've got such a great crowd coming through and a broad range of interest that uh, um, and it's and it's priced within a range we should get it sold. While Ladd has been a gallery owner in Lexington since 1974, this is the first time he's offered up pieces to Keeneland. Their clientele, they, they, they treat them right, they make sure everything is done to perfection uh, and make a big effort at that and uh, and I mean anybody that could be associated with Keeneland would be uh, thrilled and we're certainly thrilled with that and, and, uh, and you know we're going to we've put together an auction I think that is up to the standards that Keeneland's looking for. 